So you went from Atlanta to... Um, well, all right, so first of all, I went down to Brownsville, Texas, just the border city in Texas, like tex between Texas and Mexico. Okay. And uh, I drove down there, and I started, I started my project from there all the way to San Diego. Yep. So how many times did you stop there in the show? Uh, I guess one way. Yeah. Oh, I think I had like five. No, no, no. Um, like eight stops. How many days? How long did you drive there? Oh man, it took me like eight days. Okay, so let's stop each one. Yeah, exactly. I mean, you know, I I stop like every like I don't know four hours or something. Where did you say that? Uh, wait. Why? Did you stop every four hours? To throw the cars out? No, 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 like, I was driving for like four hours. Did you and take a break? Yeah, and take a break, and okay. yeah. What did you do during the breaks? Uh, just, you know, going to the bathroom and like, getting some like, food and stuff. Gotcha. Did so, you meet any people? Yeah, actually, um, I signed up for, um... Tinder. <laughs> no, Tinder. Oh. Uh, cop surfing. Oh, right, 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 right. Yeah, so, uh, I stayed at, um, like, two people's house, um, on the way to San Diego. And yeah, they're awesome. Yeah, awesome. Was this like a uh, regular house house or apartment or? Uh, yeah, they're in a regular house. Well, actually, um, one of them in El Paso, uh, he was living in a regular house. Okay. And, um, and the other one in uh, Ajo, Texas. No, 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 Ajo, Arizona. Ajo. Ajo, right, yeah, okay. that place. Um, they were living in a trailer. Um, trailer. Oh. But I think that was kind of like, regular style over there. Right. Like all the houses are like made of trailers. You like trailer parks? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So during this trip, yeah. You were driving and throwing the cards out? Yeah, exactly. And the cards had your phone number? Uh not my phone number. Uh I had a phone phone. So um Oh. And I yeah, that phone number was on it. And I didn't want to call it? Yeah. I keep thinking someone's gonna call you and they're gonna be like, mm -hmm. I'm getting shot at. Can you please help me? Yeah, maybe, yeah, that's, that's a possibility, definitely. Or, like, an officer is gonna call you and be like, why is all your shit over here? What the fuck are you up to? Mm hmm. But you probably would escape normal calls. Right, yeah. Yeah, I think I'm expecting. In all kinds of calls, you know, like, yeah, some would be like that, like, you know, some officers, like, you know, trying to, like, question me a lot of things, but... So um, you're going to take a phone call? Yeah, uh, yeah, I think I'm just going to get a phone from Walmart, you know. And that's the phone? Yeah, that's the phone, that's the phone right there. Yeah. So, uh, no! I know, yeah, I don't know why I couldn't pick up any calls, but, uh, I also got some text messages, and we kind of exchanged, uh, like, some, you know, like, things. What were the text messages about? Uh, yeah, they're like, you know, who is this? Like, you know, hey, I'm, you know, I just picked up your call, like, at this place, whatever, whatever. And, um, yeah. Were any of them like... <laughs> what? I don't know, what was the most interesting text you got? Uh, okay, so one of them was, uh, actually, a uh, Border Patrol officer. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> Say what? It was a text message? Yeah, it was a text message. I, I mean, we had some conversation and like, you know, I was kind of telling him that, um, you know, yeah, I'm doing this thing um, as a part of my project and um, yeah, just like trying to support the idea of like separation created by border and that kind of stuff. To support it? No, support. Oh, yeah. subvert it. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I was going to say what? Okay. <laughs> right. No, support it. Gotcha. Yeah. Gotcha. But, um, yeah, and he was like, yeah, I'm a border patrol officer and like, you walk in and like, like some place in Texas, and I was like, okay, uh, that's that's cool. And he was like, yeah, like his te one of his text message was like, are you female? Ugh. And I was like, whoa, this is creepy.
and also I got stopped by a lot of um, um, border patrol officers. Man, there are so many checkpoints. I believe it. Yeah, and like, yeah, like the first question is always like, are you a citizen? Bitch, I might be. <laughs> yeah, I know. Maybe I'm gonna be. Maybe I'm gonna be. Yeah. And Wait, did you get nervous like the first time it happened? May yeah, maybe a little bit because that was my first time. But like, you know, like after like a couple stops, I'm like, yeah. What do you again. have? Well, so, yeah, so like, what do you have? You just have like a regular ID? Yeah, like I just have to show them like, well, I mean, you know, since they're asking me like, are you a citizen? So I'm like, uh, like no, I'm, not, I'm, not, I'm Japanese. But, yeah. <laughs> right. But yeah, I don't, I don't want to lie. So um, yeah, I just thought, I was like, yeah, I'm Japanese. And they're like, so can you, can you show me a passport or something? And yeah, with the passport, I usually show like my uh, like documents that kind of state my immigration status gotcha. and like visa and stuff. And yeah, there's one point in San Diego I got fucking detained because like they they didn't understand my immigration status. So uh, detained. I, I was in the cell. I was in the cell for like <laughs> an hour. Oh right, I remember you told me that. <laughs> yeah. What so, were you doing? Just sitting there? Yeah, I was sitting in the cell, like inside the cell. Were like, there other people in there too? No, I was just by myself. Wow. Yeah, and I was like, shit, this is like bullshit. I mean. I mean, you know, I knew I was legal, mm -hmm. so like, you know, I didn't have any fear that, you know, I'm gonna, right. yeah, I was right. gonna get deported or something. Deported to Mexico, be <laughs> Are you gonna like? So when's the last time you text someone? Uh, probably like a month ago. Yeah, yeah. People sometimes just text me like. Oh yeah, because I mean, some of them could still be there, right? Yeah, yeah, they're still there. I mean, yeah, some of them definitely. So the last text you got was last month. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Who is it from? Uh, we can check. <laughs> um, let's see. What? Yeah, you coming over here? You coming over here? Yeah. I totally forgot to reply this text message though. Yeah. It's weird. <laughs> that is weird. Yeah. Because the car says, hey there, call me or text me at 404. Mm -hmm. We can be friends. Yeah. Well, the end of it can, sounds like it can be kind of suggestive though. Right. It's yeah. like, we can be friends. Smiley face. <laughs> we can be friends with smiley face. <laughs> and then their reply is, you coming over? Right. Uh -huh. But I mean, if you're on the border... Uh -huh. Right, it's like, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah this, that could be this can. That could right, be right. I don't know. That's true. I'm interested in this idea of like separation, you know, it's totally artificial, you know, that's something we made, so. Right, you're using these places mm -hmm. that are built for separation as a way to yeah. create connections between people, mm -hmm. between yourself and other people right. that are in the area. And also I got a call from this uh, girl, um, 
in um, Marfa, Texas. Mm -hmm. uh, she was like, hey, uh, I just picked up your card. I was just walking down the street with my dog. <laughs> I just wanted to say hello. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm like, yeah, thanks. <laughs> and I, yeah, called back. Uh, but yeah, she did not say <laughs> Whatever. Yeah. You should text all of them back and see what they say. Yeah, that's true, yeah. That's true. Yeah.